today. The promise of healing is sure by his stripes. Tell me, tell me, we are healed. And the promise of prosperity is sure today because God shall supply all your needs according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. To the end, the promise might be sure to all the seed, not to that only which is of the law, but to that also which is of the face of Abraham, who is the father of us all. As it is written, I have made thee a father of many nations before him who may believe, even God, who quickness the dead and call it those things which be not as though they were. The things that be not in your life, the Lord is bringing them by creation today. Who against hope believed in hope that he might become the father of many nations according to that which was spoken so shall thy seed be and he was and be not weak in faith he's talking about you abraham and the seed of abraham and be not weak in faith he considered not his own body now dead don't consider anything of touch anything you see anything you feel, anything the doctor said, anything you dreamt about, he considered not his own body now dead when he was about a hundred years, neither yet the deadness of Sarah's womb. He staggered not at the promise of God through unbelief. He was strong in faith. Somebody there, strong in faith. My brother there, strong in faith. My sister there, strong in faith. My son, my daughter, there you are strong in faith, giving glory to God and being fully persuaded. Anybody with persuasion here today, fully persuaded, fully persuaded, being fully persuaded that what he had promised, he was able, able, able also to perform. Able also to perform. Today is the day of performance in your life. Say it, say it. Today is the day of performance in my life. May God confirm it from heaven in Jesus' name. Acts chapter 27. Acts chapter 27. Acts chapter 27. I'm reading from verse 25. Wherefore, sirs, be of good cheer. Brothers and sisters, be of good cheer. Let those tears be wiped away. Be of good cheer, for I believe God that it shall be. It shall be. It shall be. Even as it was told me, it shall be. I didn't hear you. It shall be. Say it shall be. Even as it was told me. Everything you have had will come to performance in your life. It's time, it's time to receive. Yokes are broken now. Sins are taken away. Guilt is taken away. And uh, the, the sicknesses are taken away. Yokes are broken. Today, a performance in your life. What are you? What are you? Stand up and receive. Today, a performance in your life. A performance in your life, a fulfillment in your life, the perfect fulfillment of the word of the Lord. Open your mouth and tell the Lord, open your mouth and tell the Lord, look at the prophecy concerning Cyrus, his name had been mentioned before he was born. You are not an accident, God knows you. He knows your name, he knows you'll be here. He knows you'll be here on this day. He knows you'll be making this request and he preserve for you what eyes have not seen, what ears have not heard, what has not entered into the heart of man. But the problem is they didn't stir up themselves. Stir up yourself. Stir up yourself. Stir up yourself and say, I'm not going to remain the way I was. Captivity is gone. Yoke broken. Sickness gone. The power of sin is broken. There must be a performance in your life. You are the man. You are the woman. You are the boy. You are the girl. The Lord has been waiting for you. He mentioned your name. He wrote your name. He thought about you. He prepared for you. He planned for you like he planned for Cyrus. 
all those things that disturb you, all those things that try to bog you down, they're going to be taken away, taken away a time of performance in your life, a time of deliverance in your life, a time of release in your life, a time of restoration in your life. Cheer up, my brother. Cheer up, my sister. Cheer up, son and daughter. Cheer up, because I believe God. Because I believe God. It shall be. It shall be. It shall be. Even as it was told me, it may declare to you, it shall be. No promise of God will fall to the ground. No word of God will fall to the ground. No promise, no prophecy, no pronouncement, no proclamation of the word of God concerning your life will fall to the ground. Be fully persuaded today. Be fully persuaded today. Be fully persuaded today. Everything he has said will be done. Everything he has said will be done. It may look impossible. It may look incredible. It may look unbelievable. But today is a day of performance in your life. The word which he has said will not return to him void. It shall accomplish. It shall accomplish. It shall accomplish everything that he has said. The reason why the word of God was sent to you, it will be done. It will be done. It will be done. Not staggering because of unbelief. Go strong in faith. Be strong in faith today. There's a performance in your life. A realization in your life. It will be done. If you have seen and confess your sin to the Lord, there's assurance it will forgive you. It will save your soul. If you're sick, tell the Lord about the sickness. There's assurance he will heal you. If there's any oppression, if there's any yoke, if there's any bondage, if there's any captivity, declare it to the Lord that captivity will be taken away. There's assurance today. There's assurance today of the fulfillment of the word of God. It will be done. It will be done. It will be done. Any need in your family, tell the Lord, it will be done. Your profession, tell the Lord, it will be done. Your prospects, tell the Lord, it will be done. Your spiritual life, tell the Lord, it will be done. There's a performance today. There's a performance today. There's a performance today. All is good will. All is good words in your life must be done. You're going back home with assurance. The need is met. Hopelessness is gone. Helplessness is gone. He'll fulfill his word. He'll fulfill his word. He will fulfill his word. No doubting, no wavering, no unbelief. Is God, is God, is God. We'll see whose word will stand. The word of Satan will not stand in your life. The word of false prophets will not stand in your life. The words of deceivers will not stand in your life. The word of God will stand in your life. The word of God will stand in your life. The promise of God, the prophecy of his word will stand in your life. Heaven and earth will pass away, but his word will not pass away. Fulfilled. 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 It's done. It's done. It's done. You see a performance. You see the miracle. You see the turning around. You see the going up. You see the going up. You see the going up. And the Lord will stop your spirit. Go get it. 
go get it go get it go get it don't be laid back rise up get it now it is yours now it is yours the walls of demarcation are broken down the prison doors are opened the chains and the shackles are broken the release is here already and the blessing is already there confirmed in your life praise him for that 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 blessed is he blessed is she that believed for there shall be a performance of everything the lord has spoken to you of today i believe god it shall be i believe god it shall be even as it was told me of the lord in jesus name we pray and the believing church of god said those who are delivered those who are released those who are set free those who are ready to go up and possess and they say it is fulfilled in your life in jesus name what are you raise up that hand father in the name of jesus we thank you because of the proclamation we thank you because of the prophecy we thank you because of the promise that you have given to everyone let there be a performance in jesus name forgive all their sins save their soul sanctify those who are saved and baptize in the holy ghost those who are sanctified in jesus name and every good thing you are promised in your word, I pray there will be a performance now in every life in Jesus' name. No sickness anymore will be on the body of your children. And I command that sickness come out in Jesus' name. Every oppressing spirit, Lord, you release your paper right now. Break every yoke and destroy all the works of the devil in their lives in Jesus' name abundant provision for everyone and supernatural power for everyone and the performance of all the promises of god for everyone today in jesus name confirm your blessing confirm your promise confirm the provision confirm your promises and confirm the fulfillment in every life even right now and i pray lord the joy of the lord will be the strength of your people as we're going back home, we're going back home with everything that you have done. No more tears, no more sorrow, no more heartache, no more regrets. But now there is joy. There's happiness. There's assurance. There's salvation. There is healing. There is deliverance. There is redemption. Confirm your good promise in every life, Lord. We well, thank you because we know it is done. We know it is done. In Jesus' name we pray. The reign of blessing, of miracle in the whole of the nation, Nigeria, in every city, every town, the reign of miracles will fall in Jesus' name. The Global Crusade with Kumuyi, GCK, led by Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi, has carried God's saving gospel and the wonder-working power from city to city, nation to nation. We have witnessed profound miracles as blind people see, those who are deaf hear, the lame walk, and the dead are raised to life. This month, from the great Oshobo city, Osho State, Southwest Nigeria, 
experience the miracle power of God firsthand at the August edition of the Global Crusade with Kumui, themed Jesus, the Miracle Worker. From August 24th to 29th, 2023, the crusade we hold at the Government Technical College in Oshogo at 1600 hours GMT daily and a global worship service at 0700 hours GMT on Sunday. You turn this side, miracle. You move on here, miracle. You turn the other side, miracle. Anywhere you are in the arena, anywhere you are far away there, as we pray and mention the name of Jesus, wonders will come to you in Jesus' name. It's a special divine touch for ministers, church workers, and professionals at their exclusive conference with Dr. Kumi, themed End Time Army for Latter Day Exports, at the Woke Diff Event Center, Ring Road, Oshobo. Teenagers, campus students, and young adults are in for a life-changing encounter with the power of God in the Impact Academy with Pastor W.F. Kumi themed Reigning with Christ on Saturday, August 26th at 0600 hours GMT. From every corner of the world, the global audience gathers in one accord, connected to God's word and power through satellite, radio, TV, and the GCK social media platforms. In all the countries of Africa, in all the cities everywhere, America, Asia, those who are online, you are in your home there, pay attention, you will see the miracle there. Be enthralled by a symphony of heavenly melodies as talented musicians and choirs lift their voices in uplifting praise. Special soul stirring worship will be led by world-renowned worship leader, Corey Voss. Every yoke will be broken. All the powers of the evil one will be destroyed. Bam! Miracle will come upon you. Experience power. Experience Jesus, the miracle worker. Our Father and our God, the great that I am that I am, the unchangeable God, the omnipresent, omnipotent, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you, we exalt your name because you are the, you are the El Shaddai. We worship you because there is no one we can compare with you, Father. Receive all our praises and thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. We are asking. The power of the Lord, the spirit of the Lord, we take over tonight prayer meeting and you will visit us in a mighty and powerful way in Jesus name Amen. Amen We pray that tonight there will be power in our life Tonight there will be deliverance and manifestation of the gift of the Holy Ghost and you will give everyone victory over sin, victory over Satan victory over sickness, we pray you will deliver everyone tonight and manifest your power in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We pray that for those who are sick, you will heal them. We pray that for Amen. those who have been having challenges and difficulties in life, we pray you will solve all the challenges of your people even tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We pray you will take over. We thank you, Lord, for the Amen. answer. In Jesus' you, name, we pray. Amen. Amen. I want to open your mouth to appreciate God. Open your mouth and thank the Lord. Give God the praise. Give God the glory. Give God the honor. The Bible says, Praise the Lord, all my soul, and all that is within me. Praise the Holy Name. Bless the Lord because our God is a good God. Lord, bless your name, Lord. Give God the glory. Give God the honor. Thank you. 
There is no one we can compare with our God. Thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. There is no one we can compare with ancient of days. He's a king of kings, the Lord of Lord, the unbeatable, the unchangeable, the unrepassable, the uncomfortable, the almighty, the light of the top of Judah. Worship him. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I worship you, Lord. The unbeatable God, the uncomfortable God. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless his holy name. Give him the glory due unto him, for him only and him alone is worthy of our praise. How the Lord deliver you, thank him, for his liberation in your life, thank him, for his deliverance in your life, thank him. For the manifestation of his power upon your life, thank him. For his glory upon your life, thank him. For our God has been, for our God that deliver you, protect you, preserve you, and give you another day, another chance to be alive once again. Give him the glory to you unto his holy name. Our God is good. For you being alive is a testimony. For deliverance in your life is a testimony. For the manifestation of God's power in your life is a testimony. Praise the Lord of my soul and all that is within me. Praise his holy name. Who forgives all thy iniquity, who heals all thy diseases, who redeeming their life from destruction. Worship the Lord and glorify the Lord. There is no one like our God. There is no one we can compare with him. He's a good God. He's the everlasting God. He's the eternal God. Give him the glory and worship and magnify the Lord. <laughs> Count your blessing and name them one by one. Count your blessing and name them one after the other. Count your blessing. Thank him for who you are. Thank him for his goodness in your life. Thank him for who you are. Thank him for his preservation in your life. Thank him for who you are. Thank him for his mercy upon your life. Thank him for who you are. Thank him for God's power working in you. Open your mouth and show appreciation to Jehovah. Open your mouth and show appreciation to the King of Kings. Open your mouth and show appreciation to the Lord of Lords. Give him the glory due unto his holy name. Our God is good. El Shaddai, Elohim. Our God is good. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Can I hear can I hear the victors? Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. The Bible says every man that has his hope in him is purified in said, even as he is pure. You are going to ask the Lord, oh God, watch my life. Whatever is in me that will hinder my prayer tonight, let the blood of Jesus put it out of my life. Permit yourself to the Lord, whatever that will hinder your prayer tonight, ask the blood of Jesus to place it out of your life. Lord, let the blood of Jesus. Ask the blood of Jesus to put whatever that will hinder your prayer tonight. Anything that will hinder your prayer, let the blood of Jesus take it out of your life. Anything at all? Is it anger? Is it hatred? Is it animosity? Is it envy? Is it jealousy? Is it backbiting? Whatever that we hinder your prayer tonight, whatever that will make God to say no to your prayer tonight, ask the Lord to push them out of your life. Ask the Lord to because tonight we must receive answer to our prayer. Tonight we must receive solutions to our prayer. Tonight we must, we must receive deliverance to our prayer. Tonight there must be an open door in your life, in your ministry. Tonight the power of God must eat you and locate you. Whatever that what will hit that the prayer of God upon your life, where can you ask the Lord? Oh God, push them out of my life. Oh God, place them out of my life. I want to hear the people of God praying. I want to hear you pray. 
Sister Esther, he moved yourself and pray for Brother Paul, he moved yourself and pray. Brother Benny, he moved yourself and pray. Brother Ojo, he moved yourself and pray. Open your mouth and call upon the Lord and go give him and say, God, whatever that will hinder my prayer tonight, the efficacy of the blood, the power of the blood, the cleansing of the blood, and the efficacy of the blood of Jesus to wash them out of your life, to place them out of your life, every man that has this hope in him, the Bible says, is purified himself, even as he is pure. Call upon the Lord. Purity of heart is necessary. Call upon the Lord. Deliverance of heart is necessary. Call upon the Lord. Ask the Lord. Ask the Lord. Ask the Lord. Because when Christ will come, there is a fortune season. There is a fortune period. Watch me, O God. I shall be watched. Cleanse me, O God. I shall be cleansed. Purify me, O Lord. I shall be purified. Life breaks me, O God. I shall be life blessed. Any spot in my life, any wrinkle in my life, any blemish in my life, any iniquity in my life, why can't you ask the Lord, O Lord, tonight to flush them out? O Lord, tonight to bless me. O Lord, tonight to watch me. O Lord, tonight to purify me. Who shall ascend to the east of the Lord? Who shall dwell in his holy place? He that has a clean hand and a pure heart. Is your heart pure? Is your life pure? Is your thought pure? Is your mind pure? Why I said to ask the Lord, oh God, pureness of heart, purity of heart, holiness in my heart. Oh God, I pray tonight. Commit your life before the Lord and ask the Lord to grant you that holiness of heart and life. Pray tonight. This is prayer of preparation to receive the spectacular. This is prayer of preparation to receive the divine. The divine thought. The spirit of preparation so that you can key into God's agenda. Why can't you ask the Lord? Look at me, oh God, cleanse me. Are you praying? If a man swear, please the Lord, he make even his enemy to be at peace with him. Are you praying? Are you crying to God and say, God, make me to be like my master. Let me to be like Jesus. Make me give me the mind of Christ. Do you have the mind of Christ in you? The heart of Christ in you? The nature of Christ in you? Why can't you ask the Lord? Oh God, give me the nature of Christ. Oh God, give me the heart of Christ. Oh God, purify my heart and impart in me upon my life the nature of Christ. The nature of Christ. Oh God, impart in my life the nature of Christ. Ask the Lord to transfer the nature of Christ in your heart. Ask the Lord to watch your heart, to cleanse your heart, and to read righteousness upon you. Holiness unto the Lord all the days of your life. Are you holy like Jesus? Are you pure like Jesus? Are you gentle like Jesus? Are you upright like Jesus? It is enough for the, for the disciples to be like his master. How, how far and how close are you to Jesus? Why can't you ask the Lord, oh God, walk upon my heart? Why can't you ask the Lord Lord, oh God, my brother, pray. This is a great deliverance prayer you need that casting out demons. This is the number one prayer you need that God will make you to pray like Jesus. If a man say, please, the Lord, the Bible say, he make people his enemy to be at peace with him. Call upon the Lord, call upon the Lord, does your way, please, the Lord. Call upon the Lord, does your own God, please, the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Why can't you ask the Lord? Oh Lord, God of heaven, let my way please you. My conduct please you. My character please you. My act please you. Everything in me that is not bringing glory to your name. Oh God, push them out. Oh God, bless them out. Oh God, purify them out. Oh God, make me to be like Jesus. Are you like Jesus in your thought? Are you like Jesus in your heart? Are you like Jesus in, 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 in your mind? Are you like Jesus? Do you, do you, do you, do you uh, how do you resemble Jesus. Why can't you ask the Lord? I want to be like Jesus. I want to be like Jesus. Master Jesus reign in my heart. I want to be like Jesus. Master Jesus reign in my soul and give me victory. Pray. Call upon the Lord. When a man will please the Lord, he make even his enemy to be at peace with him. Why can't you pray? Immute yourself and pray, my brother. Immute yourself and pray, my sister. Call upon the Lord. You are the God of us. Call upon the Lord. You are the Savior of all. 
Whatever defeats you in the past, my brother, you can overcome those things. Whatever overcome you in the past, my sister, you can overcome all those things. As the Lord will be the power upon your life. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. I want to appreciate all those who are praying and praying to God because the Lord, the Lord, the Lord is going to perfect everything in our life, even tonight. And as I told you, the team of tonight prayer meeting is power over sin, power over sickness, and power over Satan. Whatever has oppressed your life, whatever has overcome your life, after tonight's prayer online conference, you will have power and you will go back. You will overcome the Goliath in your life. You will overcome all the challenges in your life from tonight Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. You are going to pray. Whatever may be the challenges confronting you, you are going to ask the Lord, oh God, give me power to reign in life. Oh God, give me power to reign in, in life. Oh God, give me power to reign. To reign. Why can't you ask the Lord to give you power to reign? Power over Satan, oh God, give me power to reign. Power over sickness, oh God, give me power to reign. Power over sin, oh God, give me power to reign. Open your mouth and pray, ask the Lord to give you power to open your life. You will reign like Father. And then for our presence in law, and every time we go to life, we will not be able to do it. You will not be my friend. Trust the Lord to give you power to reign. If I make you this and make this in life, call upon the Lord, call upon the Lord. In the name of Jesus, 
the Lord and the power of the Lord must flow in your life. The spirit of the Lord and the power of the Lord must be spread upon your life. Power to raise your life. In the name of Jesus. Power over sickness, receive the power. Power over sickness, receive the power. Power over affliction, receive the power. And the Lord, you must be my brother, let it be broken. We pray. This year, in our ministry, the Path Christian Life Ministry, got 50 years in this month, and then by the special grace of God. The church mm-hmm. we are we are celebrating the the 50 years anniversary. You have started already from 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 DLCC, and on Sunday there are going to be a great trans a great uh, um, um, jubilee all over all over mm-hmm. the the the, the uh, um, where the church has been located. 50 years anniversary. You know that. When the children of Israel become 50 years, there was liberty in them. When they become 50 years, there was deliverance. When they become 50 years, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord released all the slaves, they released them. Everything that would be in captivity, God set them free. You are going to pray. As the ministry celebrates 50 years anniversary, you are going to start your own celebration tonight. Yes. Oh God, yes. every bondage in my life. As the church celebrating anniversary let every bonus get out is, let every step away way way. let every sickness be healed come and call the law that goes to be break deliverance every bondage go we break every bondage in your life every bondage in your soul every bondage in your spirit as the Lord will show every bondage will set you free as the Lord will set you free from every bondage as the Lord will break your feet and the Lord will claim your claim your big claim of deliverance claim your big claim of freedom Claim your victory of dominion, your victory of, 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 of advancement. But I to ask them, oh God, I will not pass you as the church celebrated in the past. We are going to pass you. Every pressure of the man left out of God, out of the land, of God, he never pass you. Every bondage out of the man's life, of God, he never pass you. Every bondage out of the man's life, of God, he never pass you. Every bondage out of the man's life, of God, he never pass you. Every bondage out of the man's life, of God, he never pass you. Every bondage out of Thank you. 
The Lord will provide all our needs financially. The Lord will provide all our needs socially, maritally. Call upon the Lord in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. We are going to pray for some of our brethren who is far. It's very difficult to get married. There are some of our brethren, sisters, 38 years, no husband. Sisters, 40 years, no husband. Some brothers, they are 45, 42, 38. They are still praying. Not, not really showing up. We are going to pray. As many who are due for marriage, as many who are still praying for the will of God, whatever is blocking their marital breakthrough, let's pray God will deliver them. Let's pray God will connect them. Let's pray God will give them the bone of their bone, the flesh of their flesh. Let's ask the Lord to connect them to their soul, to their partner. Oh, we pray for our brethren. Call upon the Lord for their behalf. We pray for the will of God in marriage. Yes. All the coverage that is covering their eyes, whatever kind of thing they have to cover them, let's ask the Father. We destroy that power by fire in the name of Jesus. in Jesus name we pray amen let's also pray those who have marriage and they are going through challenges and tough time in their marriage let's pray oh that god almighty we visit them anybody going through tough time in his medical life let's pray that god will bring god will bring solution and god will remove all the challenges all the blood of the devil all the arrow the devil the devil have set it to any any family let's pray for that from him the lord will come and visit you in your life of every country the lord will deliver any people that are going through stop who stop in their marriage there will be peace there will be deliverance oh we want to pray for any couple that is going through challenges in their marriage Life. Those who have been married, no children, God will give them children. Those, those who have been married, God will take marriages away from, from the midst of the people of God. All the arrow of Satan in the American life, God will scatter the arrows. God will bring peace upon every family. Ask the Lord to bring peace upon every upon every family every family represented this online prayer meeting let the power of God intervene in their marital life oh. 
Have your way, oh Lord. Open your mouth and pray. Oh Lord. Amen. Power that devil that would come and visit in my life, in life and my family. Come and visit to destroy by fire. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. I want you to pray for one of our sisters. The children are not uh, taking care of her. And he is the one that brought those children up. We are going to pray as many that belong to that category that the, 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 they have children and in their old age and the children is not taking care of their parents. Let's pray that any family that the children are not taking care of their parents, let's pray any power that is, that is turning the heart of those children children against their parents. Let's pray that God will liberate those powers. Let's pray God will talk the act of those children. Let's pray that from now those children will be able to take care of their parents. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Anything you pray that have found out their parents and they will be able to take care of their parents as God brought all my children. The act of those children and those children they should be counseled in the in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Listen to me, my, my brothers and sisters. There was a particular family. The parent had the children and all that. When the parents died, the uncle take over those children. The uncle was living with those children. And then those children now grew up. Somebody now turned the heart of those children against the uncle with, with, with demonic power, evil power. Mm. And those children did not want to take care, take care of, the, of their uncle after the parents have passed away. And then the matter get to rush. We began to pray. We began to pray. We began to pray. That is how God delivered those children. They were saying, where's our uncle? Ah, what happened? In fact, the, the story got to a point that the, the woman that was behind it now confessed what he did. That those children, they have grown up, and those children, they, they have made it in life. The woman turned the heart of those children towards her. Ah, the, the, they make those children to forget their uncle. We are going to pray. Any power that is working against our children, that they refuse to take care of their parents in their old days, let's pray. God Almighty will destroy those parts of those children. Power and and those children, let's pray. God will give the God will give us the grace for them to retrieve their parents and to, 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 to take responsibility to take care of their parents, to take care of their uncle. Let's call on God and ask the Lord that our children will take care of the of their parents. I know what I am saying. There are people that have children and the children is not taking care of their parents. Let's pray and let's call on
In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are still going to pray for the families. We are going to pray. Any hope the devil is targeting to scatter. Any family the devil is, is targeting to destroy. We are going to pray that God will destroy the work of the devil against any home in any family. All the plans of the devil in any family, in any home, in this prayer conference, ask the Lord to destroy every strategy, every plot of the devil against any family, against any of our brothers. We come against you, Father. 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 We come Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. You are going to pray for every family that is online tonight. You are going to pray. Every family represented online tonight. You are going to pray. Let God provide every need of each family. Spiritual Amen. need, physical need, material mm. need, financial need, ah. hope. You must have prayed that everyone represented in each family online tonight ask the Lord to provide all our needs. Our Father, 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 of you that you you emote yourself, but when you emote yourself, those of you that emote yourself, emote yourself and pray. It is my character. You are not as you are not as you are not as you are not as you are Somebody said, somebody said, I will never let you go or else you hit me. This person went heal him. He has written to us to, to pray for him that God should heal him. Let's pray for him that this writer, God will heal him. All the affliction, all the sickness. Let's pray. God will make every sickness out of his life. The power of his nation, he will be recovered. All of you he said, I will not let you go. And then you heal me. Let's pray for him. The power of God will heal him. So God has prayed on the other in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to pray. 
the Lord God Almighty will sustain our lives. Amen. No death. Amen. You are going to Amen. pray against Amen. every instrument of death oh in any God. home, in any family Amen. that is pre presented this all light tonight. Oh every Father. arrow of death. No, every program of death, every piece of death, we cannot die. Let's pray. Let's walk out and destroy every every piece of death against any family, against any home, against any children, in any of our family in this prayer all night. You shall not die. My brother, you shall not die. 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 You we pray. Finally, Amen. You are going to pray. And the prayer you are going to pray tonight is that, oh God, enlarge me spiritually, maritally, financially, socially, oh God, I need, en I need enlargement. Call upon the Lord that God should enlarge you. Oh God, and the Lord enlarge Jabez. He blessed him, and the Lord also enlarge Jabez. Why can't you ask the Lord, oh God, enlarge me? I am due for promotion, promote me. Oh God, enlarge me. I am due for blessing, bless me. Oh God, enlarge me. All of God, the Lord, God will enlarge you. In your place of war, promotion is coming to you. In your place of war, God will promote you. God will enlarge you. Promotion, God will promote you. Ask the Lord will enlarge you. Spiritually, financially, physically, materially, enlarge me. All of God, Jesus, name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want to call on Brother. Uh, Allah Kule, Brother Allah Kule, can you please run up the prayer for us? Just help us to run it off so, as a match we take over fathers. Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Oh my Father, we appreciate your name. We thank you for the prayer. We thank you for the way you have helped us. We are praying for you. All the requests we are telling them already. My son, spirit lady, she is not on me. Amen. For the 
in it, Lord, in him right now, Jesus name. Amen. Oh Lord, we have requested. Bless every one of us in Jesus' name. Pray. Uh, before we round up on behalf of the church, I want us to sing this song and then I want uh Lord foolishly again to let me take notes if there's anybody that raised me, I couldn't see Pastor Michael line, that is any prayer request so that you will help me uh, table it before the congregation you will hear me. But before, on behalf of the church, let us sing this song. We are grateful, oh Lord, we are grateful, Lord. I want to hear your voice. We are grateful, oh Lord. but we are going to sing another song. And then I just want us to look back and look at what God has done for us. I personally, I always tell people, there is nothing I'm offering deeper life Bible church, except that deeper life Bible church is sustaining me to the, to the way to the gate of heaven. And I always tell them, I have faced a lot of challenges, both within and out like to live deeper life i want to tell them take deeper life out of my life and i become mm -hmm. self when i'm taking deeper life out of my life i'm not saying all other church are not good i always tell them i get to deeper life and i find rest upon what i will have destroyed my life totally nobody will have ever know who is my <laughs> Oh Lord, we are grateful, Lord, we are grateful, oh Lord, oh, you have no more, oh, we are grateful, 
Please, in case you cannot call anybody again today, please just be here with me for prayer request. You can table it on the on, on the. I want us to sing this. What can I say? Is rejoicing, yes. and we bless you because you raise up our general superintendent over 1973. That is started ministry with 15 people. We thank you so much for what the church has accomplished since 73. 1977, we have been told <coughs> the life press was the life press was, was being created. What are we going to say in 1985 when the GSO, the great crusade in the national stadium, when many souls came into the kingdom of God? So that 1985, Father, who started in 1992 from our late mother in the Lord, who actually established the woman mirror. And that woman mirror have gone a lot, many souls have come into the kingdom of God through that woman mirror. What are we going to say? The year 2001, we have the say, 2001, at the conference in National Stadium as well, you, as we go back to reflect, reflect all the program you have been bringing souls into the kingdom of God, oh Lord, our heart rejoice. 
Pastor, the player Kumui, you are using it to lift up the banner and we are following. We pray this day, the grace of follow. We pray, release the grace of all your people in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 We also decree tonight, in this 50th anniversary that we have started already, we decree anyone online. Whatever challenges anyone is going through, spiritually, mentally, physically, materially, financially, we pray. Bring solution to everyone's problem in this 50 years anniversary in Jesus' name. Amen. Where Israel become 50 years? You told them to, re to release all those that have been under slavery. You said there was deliverance, the there was jubilee. I am not, I am praying any bondage in anyone's family, in anyone's life. We pray those bondage, we pray. Take those bondage away from the life of your people in Jesus' name. Amen. This Amen. prayer online, Father, we are asking, we are praying. In Jesus tarry by December. As we come to round up for the year in this prayer conference, we pray testimony upon testimony. You will give Amen. everyone testimony of everyone of us. We can share our testimony in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We pray that you will raise up people in our midst. Amen. That we take this prayer online to the next level. As Amen. you are promoting GCK, as we are taking GCK to the next level, this prayer online, we pray, take this prayer online to the next level in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We thank you, Lord, because you know you have answered our prayer. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 It shall meet on Saturday by the grace of the Lord. I want to remember something about that. Is it the prayer for me? Those people who are expecting uh, husband, wife, please. All those people who are let us inform Pastor Mike and then Pastor Dako. This time around, please let us concentrate on that. What is our prayer in Jesus' name? Amen. Then for the, for the Sunday, we have presented by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, we are raising four millionaires. On the among the pastors, among the group member in Jesus' name. Let's share yeah. the let's share the gift. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. 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 Jesus so Adam to see what he will call them. I was so ever Adam calls every twenty nine. Uh, I was 21, and the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam, and he slept. And he took one of his ribs, and so, and the rib which the Lord God made he proper unto the man, and Adam. And say, this is now born of much of my she shall be called woman because she was taken out of man. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This will be the subject of uh, our prayer tonight. Uh, the bone of my bone. Tonight is it's going to be a special one. I want you to pray. I want you to be ready to pray. Because this season, after a prayer of this period, you begin to see things in different dimensions. 
Uh, and I pray that the Lord will open your eyes after this prayer. Say amen. Amen. I want you to your help of prayer. I want you to commit yourself in the hands of the Lord. Through the prayer of today, I will... Father in heaven, I thank you for your goodness. I bless your holy name for bringing me to thy presence today. Lord, all I need is that you draw me okay. here around. And only hears a person's voice. Amen. I thought we are here me. together to pray Jesus. together. I thought we are here to move mountain together. I want to hear you pray. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. If you are mute, I want to encourage you that I will know if we are together. Because the devil will not rob us of our network today. In Jesus' name. Amen. And so we want to be in the same realm and to be very sure we are flowing together. And so, uh, so that we won't be lost uh, uh, while the prayer is going on. So I need your cooperation, so support us together. Uh, yeah. Amen. 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 Good. Tonight, we are considering the bone of my bone. Network is so bad, so bad. Not hearing at all. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Mm. I was saying this, that it can be so frustrating when a father is calling his child and the child go and meet his friend. Are you the one calling me? You, you want to know how frustrating that could be. And so the problem of man is that God speaks. The ability to hear God speak is the barrier. And tonight, what we want to do is to take away that barrier. 
How do you know that it is the same way God speaks that the devil also speaks? Amen. If you are with me, say amen. 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 The same way God speaks is the same way. The devil will listen to that pattern. If God speaks to you through dream, the devil will observe that pattern and he will come to confuse that individual with dreams. If God speaks to you through vision, the devil follows that pattern. Okay, this is the same way he speaks. He follows that pattern and confuses you through that pattern. And so, the same way God speaks, it's the same way the devil speaks. How do you identify and how will you identify if it's God speaking? And that is what that prayer will do today. It will do it Amen. in your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. There is one thing that can cause barrier. There is one thing that can cause all obstacle. What is it? Not having constant Amen. relationship with God. Not giving God our time, not giving Him space, not allowing God to invade in your space is one of those things, a major things that can bring barrier to communicating between you and your God. And so, this season, this morning, this afternoon, this night, what we want to do now is this I want you to close your eyes, I want you to look deep. What is it that is causing barrier between me and my God? If you don't have time for God, when he speaks, you will be struggling with it to decode. Is it God speaking? Is it man speaking? When you are cumbersome with a lot of activity, hey, you know, some people throughout the day, you don't even have time to pray. You don't even have time to read your Bible. I, I tell you, it, 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 it's so devastating. And uh, Now, you want to know the will of God in what business to do. You want to know the will of God in who to marry. You want to know the will of God on what is the name I will give to my child. You want to know the will of God, what position will I occupy in the church. But the time God needed your attention 